It's a Hellcat now. Comments don't be moving me. Fuckers, they gon' do to me. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with my camera, but it keeps cutting off automatically. But I will try this for the 15th damn time. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Robin here, YouTube buddy. Back with another video. So I'm over here at none other River Oaks Jeep, guys. So uh, they they got something in. You're gonna see it in the damn title anyway. They got a 392 Jeep and an electric Jeep, if I'm not mistaken. So that's gonna be crazy but i wanted to show y'all something man uh after the youtuber call out this fog light went well not after the youtuber call out yeah kind of afterward this fog light went completely out um when i went to go give the gentleman dexter jones his hat um that light went out and all of us and i disconnected this one because i wasn't trying to look dumb with one light and one light on and one light off um it still seems like it's something wrong with it. It's not as bright as this light, but on camera, to me, it looks good. But I don't know what's going on. In the future, I'm probably gonna replace it. But like I'm saying, man, this is prototype lights. This is why I'm not selling them or none of that stuff because I'm scared stuff like this might happen. Um, but anyways, with that being said, yeah, I'm about to go roll right back down here. I seen the reflection of another car that this light was on and I disconnected this one. So I put this one, I connected this one back. Whatever, y'all don't really care. But I'm gonna go downstairs to go look at the Jeeps, but I can give y'all a glimpse of the Jeeps right now. And I'm gonna give um, one of my supporters that follow my channel, he actually works here. And y'all probably seen him on previous of my videos. He has a red scat pack. I'm gonna give him my old pedal box, man. So, not charging him, I'm just gonna give it to him, man. He always showed me love, always showed me support. And I happened to mention it one day, and he said, oh, I'll buy it from you. I said, no, you don't have to buy it, bro. I'll just give it to you. So, right here, one of these are the 392. I don't know which one it is. What's up, dude? One of these are the 392 Wranglers. I don't know which one it is. But yeah, we'll figure it out and see. It looks like they got a Hellcat in here as well. That that one is pending sale. All these are, oh, those two are Hellcats. That's a Scat Pack. That one is pending sale. He almost ran in the back of that Jeep. Uh, but he's doing a thing where he has to sign, uh, log it all in and all that stuff. Um, but I'm about to roll back down there and everything. And before somebody tries to steal my damn car. I'm about to roll back down there, go mess with everybody inside and see what they're doing. And then we have, we'll go from there. I wonder if old dude is here though. I don't even know if he's here or not. I'm going to call a trace sale car and see if he's here. I don't know who hide these cars. I don't know who hide these cars, but I'm gonna put River Oaks on blast. They got a uh, RT Scat Pack wide body. That's not Destroyer Gray, but it's the gray color. They have, have this Hell Raisin Scat Pack. And this look like a TRX. They got a T, is this a TRX? Look like a damn TRX. Who y'all hide these cars for, Blake? They hide these, man, they got some good cars over here hidden, bro. I'm gonna show y'all all these mugs, too. Look, they got a Durango Hellcat. <laughs> they got a Durango Hellcat. It looked like it's sold, and they got it blocked off with this ram, so nobody can take it. Is it sold? Oh, the vehicle sold. Never mind. That one sold. And then they have this TRX over here. 
and it's sold too. But they just sitting here, man. And then they got, I guess it's the sold area. I guess this is where all the cars are sold, I guess. I don't know. But I ain't never seen nobody buy a car and don't pick it up. And then they got a freaking red eye sitting over here. Let me guess. This one sold too. Yep, I guess this is the area where cars are sold. Shit, I know if I had a TRX, I know I'd be picking that mug up. I know if I had a scat pack, I know I'd be picking that mug up. And I damn sure know if I had a Durango, I damn sure be picking that up. I don't know, man. I don't understand how people buy cars. And then they got a red eye. Not a red eye, I'm sorry. And then they got a hat. Then they have a, uh, a red scat pack over there. Golly. But I ain't gonna cap. We're roast be selling the hell out of these damn wide bodies. So I painted all these. <clears throat> the stripes, the spoiler. He got all my parts, my wig. Oh, you, you painted shit. the stripes, you didn't do a sticker? Yeah. Oh, shit. You got the roof done. And then he painted that. He still got to paint my grills. He painted the inside of my lights. My okay. grills, my reflector lights. My door handles, my well, you mirror. You are all crazy. You crazy as hell. I'm going see through hood. What you mean see through hood? Like Red Eye Barber? Oh. Yeah, I'm going see through hood. I found the, um. Look guys, I told you I was giving it to him. Did you pay for this? Nope. I'm giving it to you, hey, right? Hey man, shout out to YouTube and on the budget. Please go, su go subscribe and make sure you like and comment on the link below. Yeah, man. Shout your stuff out, man. Oh, yeah. Please follow me on Instagram at by Devontae Brown. And my YouTube channel is by space Devontae Brown. Hey, did they, did they get to you the subscribers that we asked? Or the followers? Oh, yeah, man. I've been getting a lot of DMs. But we didn't get they to said, the... They told me stop smoking. <laughs> <laughs> they told me stop smoking. <laughs> hey, hey, man. Shout out to everybody that, that supports YouTube and on the budget. Man, he's a real genuine person. He's... Like, very yeah, that's genius. crazy. Somebody asked me just right down in my inbox. I'm like, why people hate you so much? I'm like, shit, I don't know, man. Everybody's not going to like you. I said, I don't <laughs> care who hates me or not. He said, but you don't do nothing. You're not an a hole or nothing. I'm like, man, it's always going to be people in life who hate you, bro. Right. It's never going to be that one person. Like, the whole world is never going to like you. Right. Yeah, it was just funny because he was just telling me that he's from Jamaica and stuff. Right. And he was just telling me right now. He said, man, I don't understand why people hate you. I said, bro, don't worry about it. It is, it is what it is. <laughs> But yeah, man, he got that pedal box. That boy gonna yes, be in the sir. game. He don't even have his charger right I now. My car right now is actually getting some stuff done to it. Um, but just please stay tuned. And I'm really thankful and blessed to get get this from Robert. Man, you gonna look? Hey, do not. Hey, I, I'm I'm putting this a disclaimer. I'm not responsible <laughs> if you wreck your car or anything. Yeah. Not responsible for that. All right, all right. <laughs> That's all on you, it bro. It don't come on the app, huh? That's not on your new one. Get yeah, a new one, but shit, you don't even need it, bro. Cause you, you gonna show me your new one. Hell no, I ain't letting you see that, bro. I ain't letting you. You might want to take that one out. The right. new one, I ain't gonna lie. The the main thing I like about the new one is the whole theft thing. To be honest. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Hey, did you see the 392 uh, Wrangler yet? Oh no, nah, they got it here. Trey didn't tell me. Yeah, no more. I don't think he didn't tell me. Blake told me. Blake called me. Oh wow. Yeah, so no more V6s in the 392. <laughs> so they don't have to freaking put a rip supercharging in no more. Right. <laughs> but yeah, guys, other than that, man, we finna go. Uh, they still doing the, the PDF thing. Uh, once they finish that, we'll go over there and check it out. They got a wide body scat. Are these sold yet? Uh, two of them are sold. The Let me guess, the Hellcats, Hellcats are, sold? are sold? Yeah. Oh, never mind, guys. Both of the Hellcats are sold. But order away guys yeah he could order and, and they're getting them super fast if you want a scat pack they have this one they have a gray one upstairs is that red one on the second floor for sale red one sold damn one sold. so that area right there is the sold That's area the sold section okay a lot of cool premium cars over there all right, guys. So yeah, they got the black one. Look at Hellraiser and Frostbite. Yeah. Frostbite looks good too. Hey man, hey guys, they they dishing these red eyes out like crazy, man. Y'all better come and get some, cause it's it's gonna be a it's gonna be a, a stop to these Hellcats real soon. So I can't tell you why. Just listen to what I'm saying. You won't be able to get a Hellcat pretty soon, or any Charger probably pretty soon. But I can't tell you why. Oh, it sounds way better. First look, first to Houston 392. So, did they, how much is this sold? This is sold, pre ordered, yeah. 
What? They didn't have it dropped the price yet. You remember? So, 75000 Okay, so that's not bad. That's not bad. You get the SRT motor. Hold on one second. All right. Three ninety two guys. This is a three ninety two freaking Jeep, bro. Who ever thought they'd come out with a three ninety two? And they got the rock guards on here too. I gotta let y'all see this, bro. A three ninety two in a Wrangler. So now people don't have to put the rip supercharge on them no more. But this one is sold, the Rubicon. Oh yeah, look at that. Does this thing have a hood thing? How you pop the freaking hood? 75K, this one is nice. Jeez. I swear this stuff, oh it is foam, I'm gonna say it look like foam. I don't even know how you pop the, hey comment below man, how you pop this damn hood bro? Or do it just open by itself? I don't even know how to pop the hood, dude. Oh, we got a camera in the front, too. Oh, it just opens. Oh, uh, hold on. Dude, look at that, a 392. I still can't believe they did this. Is that crazy or what? It was waiting a long time for power in the Jeep Wrangler, and it's finally here. Yeah, like, why they didn't come up with this a long time ago? It's been a long, long time. Because people do that rip supercharge. Yeah. Now they don't, now they can supercharge this if they wanted to. True. It'd be a lot faster. <laughs> you know the potentials how faster this thing could go with this 392 in here now? Crazy. The modifications that can be done to this are really off the charts. But I'm pretty sure the tuning and all that stuff, if, if people want to do all that crazy crap, oh, it's yeah. going to take a while for it. Well, I don't know. It's a 392, so I just like how they did the gold. I wonder if all of it's going to have that gold, this gold accent, because that has the gold accent. This has the gold accent. This is crazy. A freaking 392. Look guys. He still haven't sold that car yet. So he wants too much money for that car, bro. He wants too much money for that car. If you go down to 5K, man, I'll buy it. If you go down to 5K, I'll buy that mug. But yeah, that's the 392, man. This thing is crazy. Um, I don't know, uh, for an off-road vehicle, you could pro-charge this, you could supercharge it, you could do a lot to this motor. But now that, man, I promise y'all, Fiat, FCA, I don't know who owns this crap, whatever. They're going crazy with these motors. They're putting, next is gonna be a Hellcat motor in the damn Wrangler, bro. I promise you. Cause they're going too crazy with all this stuff, man. Um, y'all comment below, do y'all think it's a better option to have a 392 in here versus a V6? I think so. Um, where's Eric at? 470 horsepower. How much? 470. Zero to 60 in four and a half seconds. 6.4 liter V8. That's crazy. Yeah. I wonder what took them so long to do this. Like, why they didn't do this from the get-go? Because if you look at all the YouTube videos, people who go off-roading, yeah. they do a lot of upgrades, like rip supercharge. Ton, ton of people out of there. Like, of people out of they should have done this a long time ago. Oh, look, they got another one right there. There's the electric range. Oh, that's a, that's a hybrid? That's a hybrid, 4xE. Four 4xE. Four e. Look how quiet that is. Yeah, that's you can't different. Hit the gas one time. Hit the gas. You can't hear, it. This is you can't hear nothing. Did you hit the gas? You hitting the gas? Oh my God! You can't hear nothing. <laughs> you can't hear nothing. <laughs> Four by E, guys. Four by E. That is crazy. So it still takes gas, it's a hybrid. 
but it still tastes gas. That's crazy, George. Yeah. And here's the, uh, the, the you want to put on. E safe hybrid electric. Oh, so you can do full electric, you do hybrid. What's E safe? That's the engine. That's what to save gas. Oh, okay. You just use the engine what it, what it needs. That's the opposite. There. Okay, okay. That's crazy. Electric. And that's full electric. And then get quiet. Hit the gas one time. You can't hear nothing. Nothing. Golly. So, how do you charge it? Oh. So does this come with the vehicle though? Yeah. yeah. Oh, the charger comes with it. Yeah. And you can plug it into a standard wall? You can yeah. plug it into a regular wall. If you plug it into a regular wall, it'll take 12 hours to fully charge. You can buy an upgraded level two charger. We'll do it in two hours. Okay. So yes, yeah, so you can buy an upgraded off Amazon. They sell them. They just. And this has the rock guards too. Yeah, it's got the rock guards. How much power there. does this one have? Do you know? So this thing's pretty nasty. Um, it's got a 2.0 liter turbocharged motor in it, okay? It's got an electric range of 21 miles. It's got a full range of 370 miles hybrid, uh, which is really, really impressive. The coolest part is when you turn this thing on, you just you can't you, hear you, it. You can't hear it at all. I still um, I still rather the 392. The, the 392. I'd rather pay more gas. Now this is, don't get me wrong, this is like top level. It's just, it, it, but for performance and power, this thing is so fast. Yeah. I mean, not as fast. Because, but compared well, to the, off the line, this should be winning. It should be winning. Because it's, it's, in mind, this is 30,000 less than that. Oh, this is cheaper? Oh yeah, the electric one's like within the range of- So this is like forty, fifty thousand dollars 50000 this one here is I think probably sixty because it's the Rubicon, but normally- it's, Oh, it's the Rubicon, okay. Yeah, normally it's between forty to sixty. Is this one sold? This one is sold, yeah. Golly, yeah. everything is sold around here. Yeah, keep in mind, whenever they release the products for the first time, they, it's pre orders. Pre orders, right? Okay, so, so if y'all want. They got a pre order, okay. they're the first two. So if you want the FXE. The 4 by e 4 by E, Robert, okay. We're you into the Jeep yeah. Thing, man. 4 by E. Guys, y'all think Robert should get a Jeep so that he can better understand the Hey, I, honestly, guys, really, we was talking about, I wanted to, I was going to lease a white one, yeah. a 392. But they didn't come out with the price forever. They yeah, took they forever. They never dropped the price. So I don't know, man. 75000 for a Jeep Rubicon 392. I don't know, man. I don't know. I could do something else with $75,000. <laughs> uh, maybe another, uh, maybe a Durango or something. I don't know. Oh, yeah. What are they, I, I still. Coming out? Man, you think that's for real though? I, I think know. it's April Fools. I don't know. I, I really want to get a track hawk. I'm trying to get a track hawk. That's where I really want. They're coming out. Oh, what's that white one back there? That's not. It's an SRT or a track hawk. Wow. That's not neither one. Never mind. That's a regular one. It looks good from right here though. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, guys, uh, we finna go to do a real and a full review. If you want to see a full review, on on the 4XE. 4XE. Um, 4xe 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 all the jeeps are 4x4 four four, but yeah it's 4xe four because four four e. electric okay and but is it still 4x4 four four, though it's still 4x4 four four, and they went with the blue theme so normally they're doing red but since electric they put the electric blue on there which is kind so of is this going to be gold because i know this or that's just an accent color he that's picked just the accent color for the 392 um standard on it but they have multiple colors for that okay so you don't have to pick gold you don't have to pick gold no. okay all right, so yeah, if you want to see the full review of this electric Jeep, gold is standard as an accent color, but you can. I would upgrade that. I would have. I would put. I put red. Yeah, but it looks good though. If you want to see the full review video of the of the 392 Wrangler, brand new guys, something they should have done a long time ago, if you ask me, or if you want to see the 4 by E, make sure you go to River Oaks Jeep on YouTube and go check out their Instagram on. Uh, oh, you know what else? I like this hood better too. So yeah, look at look at it. Yeah, look look at the vent. The That's like a uh, charger almost. Yeah. So if you want to see this, um, I want to make sure I do this right. Yeah, there you go. If you want to see this on a full review, make sure you go to River Oaks Jeep. Man, we're gonna do a full review on this uh, vehicle and it show all the specs and all that stuff. Man, guys, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. At first, I was the fan of the whole 392. But that Ford F A E F, that Ford, not Ford, that Jeep four by E, is freaking amazing, man. It's freaking amazing, dude. Um, yeah, it's freaking amazing. I, I don't know what else to say about it. I don't know what else you could do about it. But that's the future, bro. 
Like, I just, I think honestly that with how the world is going with pollution and all this stuff, I think that's gonna be the future of the, the, the Jeep Ram Chrysler fleet, man. So I learned a lot, man. If you really wanna hear it, the vehicle in detail, please make sure you go to River Oaks Jeep Ram and they can have, oh, what the hell is, what is going on? They got a freaking Longhorn up here, bro. Oh my God. They got a damn Longhorn. What the hell is going on? They got a whole freaking... Oh. Oh, I'm not getting nowhere near this thing. Damn, that thing is huge. That thing is huge. Jeez. <laughs> is it a boy or a girl? It's a boy. What's his name? Jax. No, no, oh, no, 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 no. Sure. No, 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 no. But you'll need that for your video, huh? Oh, also. Oh, his name is Tex. Yeah. Oh, you went to Alamo. Uh-huh. Is she the only one allowed to ride him? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Oh, you do birthday parties and events and weddings and oh, stuff. We do all kinds of okay, things. go ahead. Go ahead and tell what you do, man. Yeah, we do uh, birthday parties, weddings, parades, awesome. corporate events, anything like that. Man, that thing is how much he weigh? He's nine years old, he weighs twenty five hundred pounds. Damn God. Twenty five hundred pounds. So we him from his mom, he's a sweetheart. What's the life expected on him? Uh late twenties or Oh that's 30s. that's thinking a good life then. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Nine years old, that's a big boy. Yeah. Man, y'all want y'all want uh Tex over there. Hey, shout out to him, man. What's your name? Brian Black. Brian Black, man. I have the card out. The the oh, there you go. Oh shoot, you a singer too. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Look, Jer hit up Jerry Creek for the uh for any bookings, guys. That's pretty cool, man. Hey, thanks a lot, man. Good awesome, man. Thank you. Good to meet you. I like this man, that's crazy. <laughs> that thing is crazy big. His name is Tex. What's up, bro? And thing is huge, 2,500 pounds. Golly, I guess that's his ride right there. And look, he's pulling it with a ram. That's all, folks.